Today we are discussing the insertion sort, one of the best sorting algorithms. There are two types of sorting algorithms, generally uh, the comparing each, each with another, that is the comparing number with each with other and other is non-comparing, that is radix sort, bucket sort. In comparing each and uh, each with other, that is generally O n square, that, that can be divided by two, like uh, divide and conquer that is march sort, quick sort, heap sort, generally the complexity is n log n to the base 2, another is the not divide and conquer, there they come bubble sort, selection sort, insertion sort, these are three sorting technique. Amongst these insertion sort is one of the best algorithm and sometimes you will see in the even the quick sort, even the heap sort, march sort, when the number of elements comes to around 32, then we go for hybrid sort arrangement. We will go change to the insertion sort. The insertion sort, when the number of elements is 32, it is much, much faster than March sort, quick sort, or hip sort. Uh, let's start it. So, insertion sort is nothing but whenever we play a game of cards, we generally place like this 7 here. We got the 7 here, 10 here, if something comes, we, we sort it each one with, uh, till up to this. So, like this, any unsorted, we put it into sorted. So, it will, the, this blue portion, it will grow and this unsorted portion will become nil. So, this is the basic algorithm in such of sort and what is the comparison with the selection sort? Selection sort, we will see we will go for the minimum here and bring it here, then again go for minimum here and bring it here. So, this is a selection sort. There is one advantage case of selection sort will be there, we will see the selection sort when the positions comes to the, this is the final positions, uh, like quick sort, like uh, is it pivoted. Uh, that is when the that particular in, uh, record is very heavy, lot of data, then instead of insertion sort, maybe the selection sort will be better. The selection sort uh, position is finally. It will not, after it positioned it and sorted, it will not be uh, again uh, changed. So, that is the only advantage of selection sort. But in, remember, selection sort, the complexity in the base case also O n square. In insertion sort or in bubble sort, we will just check whether uh, any almost uh, sorted array is there, almost or fully sorted, it will take just to the O n. Uh, even bubble sort, even insertion of n, but in selection sort it will be own square and that is it. Uh, so, the next screen, say this one example, see here the first pass, only the 1 will be uh, here and then the 10 becomes here, uh, this is a sorted portion, then the uh, finally 2, this is one more example of selection sort. Uh, sorry, insertion sort. Uh, this is a, from Coleman's book. Same type of example. You can find it from the Coleman's fourth edition book. This is the comparing of the selection sort and insertion sort. Since your selection sort finds smallest element, the, the second smallest element, the third smallest element. So, but it is goes to the final position. And insertion sort makes sure the first element is sorted, then first two are sorted. Then first three are sorted. It is O n square. On average, uh, insertion sort is uh, twice as fast as selection sort. So remember, the, uh, insertion sort twice as fast. Is this this O n square? There is some factor called constant one and constant two. The C one is much less, uh, 0.5 of selection sort. It can be proven. This is the algorithm of insertion sort. Very simple algorithm. It can be from Coleman's book. The insertion sort, a bubble sort, uh, selection sort, one good advantage is if they are all stable sort. Stable sorting means if the uh, two keys like here the green 10 and the red 10, uh, whenever it will be sorted, the green will be again uh, uh, positioned before. Same is here, if the red 20 and green 20, the red 20 and green 20, this order will be maintained. But that cannot be said in heap sort that cannot be said in quick sort, these sorts are unstable sort and uh, 
this all this comparison this sort like here double sort selection sort insertion sort this uh, sorting is stable that is a great advantage mass sort is also very stable algorithm not very stable means here the input order should be maintained and output that means the stability it, it does doesn't mean whether it is a something trembling or something like that it is the input order should be maintained this is I took the example for Wikipedia. The, here the same thing, the fiber hertz and fiber speed, uh, the order should be here in stable. If it is not stable, it might sometimes come here and this comes. But this is uh, unstable, like heap sort, like quick sort. The complexity of insertion sort in the worst case, the array is the reverse order. It is a rarest case, the totally reverse, then it is over n square. And in the base case, it is O n, but in selection sort, it will be always O n square. So that is it uh, for the insertion sort. And insertion sort advantages is simple to implement, program is code is less, efficient for small data set, adaptive, run very faster because it does not take any extra space like mass sort. So it can be in memory sort of, in memory, the in memory sort is selection also, bubble sort also, heap sort also. But it is very faster uh, in amongst the selection sort, bubble sort and insertion sort, this is the stable sort and this is the uh, two times faster than selection sort that I mentioned and does not need any extra memory. Uh, this advantage is quadratic time complexity, that quadratic complexity we can only manage whenever we will go for divide and conquer sort of thing like mass sort, n log n and the uh, heap sort, n log n. Here, this is interesting graph. Here, I wish to say this point is around 32. So, whenever the data is less than 32, insertion sort is much quicker. When the data becomes more than 32, and this is mass sort is the uh, faster. So, so whenever even the mass sort, whenever you divide and divide and divide, uh, the better sort hybrid sorting algorithm is better. When the count till uh, 32 or 16 you can change to the insertion sort. This is called hybrid sorting algorithm. Uh, modify the mass sort algorithm to switch to insertion sort when the input gets sufficient. So, this is a hybrid sort algorithm. This is, you can see here, this, this is a mass sort and this is hybrid mass sort. That means, mass sort, uh, whenever 32 comes, it will comes to the insertion sort and it is much quicker. Say it is around 100k data, it is 0 0.060 and here 0 0.019. If you say another extreme case, say uh, some 1900k data, here it is a lots of advantage. And quick sort is uh, quicker than mass sort, and quick sort you can see the much advantage. Here also, quick sort, uh, when the any particular segment uh, less than 32 will change to the uh, mass sort, but here it is not modified quick sort, it is pure quick sort where I take the pivot randomly. Remember, quick sort pivot selection is a vital. Uh, it has been seen that we should not take the first element or last element, it is better to take a, any random as a pivot that is best or median of 3. Uh, median of 3, fast, last, and middle, but you have to compute fast, last, and middle, you have to need some competition time, it is better to go for. Uh, take any element at a time as a pivot and uh, pivot will be fixed and all the elements in the left hand side will be less than pivot and greater than well right, uh, right of pivot. So, uh, here also the pure quick sort, it is not uh, by hybrid quick sort. Here we can see insertion sort, uh, selection sort, you, you can you see he, definitely it is much faster, insertion sort is much faster than selection sort for 10,000 data and mass sort uh, definitely n log n uh, is might be faster and there is some hybrid mass sort whenever 32 elements will change to insertion sort. So, I am taking all the data from uh, Stanford. Uh, this is a sorting algorithm. Remember, uh, comparing between mass sort and heap sort, heap sort is faster than mass sort. Both are n log n but heap sort is faster than mass sort, but heap sort is not stable, uh, but mass sort is stable. 
and amongst the bubble sort, insertion sort and selection sort, insertion sort is the best in the most of the cases uh, and selection sort is worst in most of the cases. Uh, whenever the very uh, small memory uh, is at your say any embedded device, there we have to do, we cannot do for mass sort, you need extra space in memory, then we have to depend on this kind of sorting algorithm, insertion sort much better than selection sort is faster. This is insertion sort advantages, uh, I mentioned this is uh, in place O1, it is adaptive and it has average when square, in the disadvantage quadratic when square, when the uh, data is uh, totally reversed in order, then it will be when square generally. Let us go to the code, uh, let us go to the code here. Here. See here, this is our program in your uh, shared Python Google Colab. We just try with one code here, we say we put one very small number say minus 4 uh, and greater number say 100. I have just this uh, list. I add two number and it run this program. You see here, uh, the minus 4 put it here and 100 put it here. This uh, program is shared with uh, view in the link, you can see it. This code is given, thank you for